after a quick cold shower, we decided to have an art adventure day, but that got interrupted by last minute van repairs. Follow along with us as we show you what van life is really like in Adelaide. First stop was the Art Gallery of South Australia. In most Australian art galleries, general admission is free, and some special exhibitions have a charge. I like going to art galleries because it's an easy way to learn about local history and see some amazing pieces of art. Inspiration can come from the weirdest places. Welcome my friends, drink with a noble heart, but yet before you drink too much, depart. For through good drink will make a coward stout, yet when too much is in, the wit is out. After the art gallery, we decided to stop somewhere for lunch. But little did we know, that was going to throw all the plans out the window. Nice car! Cricket right from our van, here in Adelaide. This ball... hit our van while everyone was playing cricket earlier. This judged our street lights by a little. Can we put them a little bit further up? Giving our van some love here at the Oil Change Express in Moss and Lake, sadly. What that is now is like chocolate. Nice and murky. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's supposed to be clear? Yeah. Or red? No, no, yeah, some of them are, but the one we're putting in, it's clear. Thank it depends God. on the vehicle, but yours, this should be clear. <laughs> so it's that dirty. <laughs> yeah. After servicing the van, we decided to go on a street art adventure through the industrial streets of Adelaide. I can see the horse's butt. We've seen a handful of no chariot signs here in Australia. Missed it. Can you go see it? Kinda. You could make a right hand turn at this thing and my bed will go over there. She's not gonna be happy. <laughs> I think she likes the challenge. <laughs> <laughs> so she tells us that you turn then she's not happy. Driving around industrial Adelaide, trying to find some cool graffiti we saw from the highway. There's a house back there. Oh, there's Smithing though. All these bridges. Wow. Welcome to the Bradley boat. This might be Lindsay's first time climbing a fence. It's the same bird mask that's in Melbourne. It is. See? Oh, West End is a beer. So they have drive through hotels here that are not places you sleep. They're actually bottle shops. It's Cobbler Reserve. This is a reserve specifically for cycling tracks. I should say mountain biking tracks. Ain't no mountain though. They have double diamond and easy ones for kids to learn. It's a pretty cool reserve right in smack dab in the middle of Adelaide. Just kind of stumbled upon it after going and getting our oil changed and seeing to some van stuff. Barbecue time in Australia. This is our first time trying one of these newfangled uh, Australian barbecues. We're gonna cook up some heart shaped schnitzel here. Warning, snakes may be present. If you find yourself close to a snake, stand still and wait for it to move away from you slowly move away from the snake. Snakes are unlikely to attack. 
After lunch, we decided to go on a walk to the marina and found another Australian animal that could potentially kill you. So it's jellyfish season. Oh. That's so cool. Just so cool. After admiring these jellyfish from afar, we decided to head back to the free camp to get a good spot for the night. That is unbelievably gorgeous. One of the best things about Adelaide van life is that the beach is west facing and it has amazing sunsets. Even though we didn't make it in time for this sunset, we got a drive that was breathtaking. Oh my gosh, and that clock tower there. fraction of its former glory, but this is what traveling is all about. Swan flying right over the horizon there. The one cloud. Head from the right. I hope you enjoyed this video about van life in Adelaide. Hit the subscribe button, give it a like, and we'll see you in the next video.